Welcome to this episode of Forex Trading Tips. Today's topic, trading with limit and limit entry orders. FXCM offers a wide range of order types through its various trading platforms, which allows a trader to approach the markets from many different angles using any number of different trading strategies. The most common order type is the market order. This order is usually the best option when a trader needs to enter or exit a trade on the fly. Market orders get you in and out of trades right now at the current market price. At FXCM, we found that most traders use market orders to open and close all of their trades, even when a different order type may be more suitable to use. So let's talk today about limit and limit entry orders to help you become a more flexible trader, and maybe even help you make some more money. A limit entry order differs from a market order in two primary ways. First, a limit entry order requires that you specify an entry price where you want to enter a trade. So let's say the market is trading around 85.7 and you want to buy but only if the price falls to 85.3. With TradingStation 2, click on the Entry button. Select a currency pair, Buy or Sell, and then type in 85.3. Once you click OK, the order appears in the Orders window. If the market falls to 85.3, the order will trigger automatically and enter you into a buy trade, on one condition. And this leads to the second way in which a limit entry order differs from a market order. A limit entry order can only fill at the requested price or at a better price, where a market order can fill at the requested price, at a better price, or at a worse price. Let's assume that the limit entry order to buy at 85.3 is triggered. However, before the order fills, the price changes to a worse price of 85.35. If this happens, the execution will automatically halt and the order will once again wait for a price of 85.3 or a better price to become available. With this order type, you can never receive negative slippage, but you could receive positive slippage. Now let's move on to limit orders. A limit order is identical to a limit entry order in that you request a specific price for the order to execute, and the price the order can fill at is only filled at the requested price or at a better price. The only difference between the orders is that a limit is used to close a trade since it's associated with a specific trade. Going back to our prior example, let's assume that the entry order to buy at 85.3 executes so a live trade is now on the market. A limit order to close this trade can now be created. Within TradingStation 2, click on the empty cell in the limit column, specify an exit price, and click OK. If the market price reaches the limit price, the order will trigger an attempt to close the trade at the requested price or at a better price. So there you have it, limit and limit entry orders two new order types that you can consider using to open and close trades. At FXCM, we prefer to see more clients opening and closing trades with these order types because this way, clients can ensure that they will always get their requested price or a better price.